developments now in a fatal crash that damaged a New Haven restaurant. New Haven police say the driver killed in that crash is 22-year-old Wilmer Lopez. They also say he was involved in crashes in two other towns, too. News ace Ken Pierce has the latest on that case and the cleanup at the restaurant. It's a sandwich spot popular with lots of folks in this New Haven neighborhood, but it's closed yet again this time because an SUV slammed into it. Witnesses say that SUV was being chased by police. This was a scene Tuesday around 6 p.m. That Toyota Highlander somehow landing on top of another car. 22 year old Wilmer Lopez was behind the wheel. Police say he was first involved in accidents in Branford and East Haven. Witnesses say he was heading west on Forbes Avenue trying to get away from police. He was coming down, getting chased from the cops this way, and then he lost control right here, and then the car just started flipping. That crash killed Wilmer Lopez. One of those flips took out part of the kitchen of Scarpolino's restaurant. I was in shock when I pulled up. There were so many people here. I, I was just in shock. Scarpolino's restaurant already survived two fires, one about five years ago, the other last Thanksgiving. It was a fire that started from a cigarette butt thrown probably from a moving car, and it was a little bit of a pile of leaves outside the building and it caused the outside of the building to burn. They reopened in January. Now they're cleaning up yet again. I'm going to estimate 75 grand to, to fix that structural damage, the ceiling, the roof. The victims of the other crashes are expected to be OK, and the restaurant was closed when the crash happened. Fortunately, it missed the three-inch gas main that powers the kitchen. We weren't here. The building didn't blow up. No, nobody was walking uh, by that car. They're still trying to figure out how long it's going to take to repair everything and whether they can open up for takeout just in the meantime. And they say they're going to keep their loyal customers apprised of everything via social media. In New Haven, I'm Kent Pierce, News 8.